Hi, I'm Charles Barry and I'm the chairman for Stichting Sienners and also the project leader for Project ID. During this video, I'm going to give you some information about our organization and also about Project ID, which is intercultural debate. This is a European project, so that's why the video is going to be in English. So let's get started. So our organization strives to be an organization that promotes creativity, entrepreneurship and leadership skills within the Dutch, com Dutch Caribbean community. We are a project uh, based uh, organization, so that means we strive on initiatives within the community to better the community. So the main goal for our organization is to be an organization that stimulates, broaden creativity, entrepreneurship and leadership skills. That being said, we're also an organization that strives on projects or initiatives. So that means for us, we want to be that platform where people could come together and brainstorm about different initiatives and also execute those initiatives. Too often the Dutch Caribbean community is overshadowed by negativity or negative occurrences. And what we want to be also with this organization is give the Dutch Caribbean community a podium to profile or showcase our talents that we have within the community. So we want to be a, a organization that profiles and deliver also those gems that we need within the community and thus providing more role models for the younger generation. Now we don't want to look past those issues that we have within the Dutch Caribbean community. So we want to also give people the platform that they need to come with their initiatives to see how they could better the welfare of Dutch Caribbean people here in Holland. Now that being said, it's all in with the thought that we want to enhance the self-reliancy of people here in Holland and also increase the, the, the participation within the community. Now, that's in general about our organization. Let's get to ID. So ID stands for Intercultural Debate, and that's what we're going to organize in Switzerland. It's a partnership of three European countries, or three organizations within Europe, from Switzerland, from Romania, and also we from Holland. Intercultural Debate is what we want to organize and why we want to organize it is because we want to see how could we raise the participation of our target group, Dutch Caribbean people, within our community. And that's what the other th two organizations also would love to do. The partnership is between a youth council from Switzerland, from, I'm going to say the name wrong of course, Der Verdun Le Bon, excuse me if I say, if I say it wrong, um, a youth for Europe organization from Romania and also our organization. The intercultural debate or the intercultural program that we would love to organize or that we will be organizing in Switzerland has this as an objective. So we want to see, we're going to go to Switzerland and we're going to explore the different policies that they have there to encourage participation. We want to create a atmosphere while being there with the three organization where it's possible that we can learn from each other, we can learn from each other's culture and all of this while keeping in mind that we're going to organize a debate. We also want to see how it's possible to affect people to participate so in in the low in the in the process excuse me in the process to the debate we're gonna see how could we trigger people to become what we call active citizens our organization is a unique organization because we're not an association or a youth club we're a foundation that works on a project base so our participants are more individuals that are interested within this field. So what we're hoping is those that go with us to Switzerland will come back with different initiatives to perhaps maybe start their own club 
or start a other initiative. Um, so that's why all our participants that go with us will will be guided with different processes and also will get different training courses. So the program or the project has different phases just like every project. The three main phases for this project is the preparation phase where we form a group. The group look at what's the plan and thanks to technology we brainstorm together with the Swiss group, with the, the group from Romania and see where we could change up some stuff because it's still going to be a youth project. And of course the implementation working towards the debate there will be different programs like i said already the training courses the preparation how the debate needs to look like all of that the participants are going to execute after the debate of course we need to evaluate how stuff went so the in the evaluation we'll see about the follow-up what's going to be the next step and our hope is that we could take this same project with stuff that we learn to Romania and lastly to Holland. So where are we going? And I'm gonna say the name wrong, so forgive me. My French is that bad. Um, De Verdun Le Bon, so I was said was it's pronounced. Here's where it's Geneva, so it's a bit north of Geneva and it's about an hour and a half. All expenses will be covered so if you're going if you're selected to participate with us uh, you will be going going for seven days and this is how the schedule looks like um, seven days maximum um, and each day will be divided in five blocks and those blocks could be linked with three teams we have teams sorry the teams are project-based, so that's when we're working towards the debate or cultural, because it is an intercultural program, so we will have time to learn from each other and free time also. So, if you are interested in this program, we are looking for someone or participants between 18 and 26 years old. You have a Dutch nationality with affiliation with one of the six islands, uh, Dutch Caribbean islands, of course. Um, you're, you have interest within the European, with the European Union or citizenship or participation, um, and you're not shy to, to, to work in teams. Also, what's very important, it's the program is going to be executed in English, so you need to be able to communicate in English. All expenses will be covered. That has to do with travel and lodging. Anything that you want to buy on your private time and your free time, of course, that you would have to cover by yourself. We will have different courses that we will be providing, public speaking and debate, that I know is for sure on the on the on the program and of course at the end you will receive a certificate from the city that we're going to for more information please visit our website and keep our website always in tune share the the this program or share the website uh, we have different projects that are coming up and there will be future videos a bit more professional i hope uh, I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you get a better picture of what we're going to do with ID. Please leave any feedback or comments where we will highly appreciate it. All the best.